in shock, disbelief. How can this happen? Why did this happen? But first tonight, two families are struggling to face reality after three lives were taken this weekend on the water. Tonight, we are learning new details about three kayakers who died on Central Texas lakes over the weekend. A 31-year-old Austin teacher apparently drowned after his kayak capsized on Lake Buchanan. The woman he was with survived. And on Canyon Lake, family members found the bodies of two brothers from Kyle. They disappeared after a kayaking trip on Saturday. KXN Sophia Beausoleil spoke with their aunt, who says their family is devastated. Larry, he's so tall. He's six foot one, you know. When he, when he gave you a hug, he just bear hug you. I mean, you just felt hugged all over. 25-year-old Larry and a 17-year-old brother, Tanner Earp, shared a love for the outdoors. They love sports. They love kayaking. They love fishing. They love swimming, going in the boat. The brothers went to Jacobs Creek Park at Canyon Lake to kayak Saturday afternoon. The family says when the brothers didn't make it back home to Kyle, their father drove out to Canyon Lake and found their truck in this parking lot. My brother and his wife and other family members searched all night and um, they found, you know, the, a kayak. Sunday morning while searching with a family friend, Larry and Tanner's father found their bodies in the water with their life jackets on. We are all devastated. Until I guess you've been there, you really don't understand. A person can't understand it. Tanner was about to graduate from Lehman High School in Hay CISD. Larry worked in the home health care industry. Two brothers who had bright futures ahead of them. Two brothers whose memories will now remain in their family's hearts forever. Sophia Beausoleil, KXAN News. The family believes weather was a factor. Lake water temperatures had dipped into the 50s. Authorities are waiting on autopsy results. And as we mentioned, Julian Dahman was also killed while kayaking over the weekend. Family members told us he was very experienced on the water. His employer, Austin Discovery School, closed today to support staff during this challenging time. Dahman taught kindergarten and first grade math. Students will return to class tomorrow. Several people have died at Canyon Lake and Lake Buchanan over the last few years. In 2011, officials say they saw a record number of drownings. There were two incidents where two people drowned at the same time. One person went in to save the other. At that time, there were a lot of factors at play. Officials blamed the drought, the heat, and poor water visibility. Rescuers showed us what it looked like underwater. They had to dodge pieces of wood, boat anchors, fish hooks, and other debris just to find those victims.